It's a great honour for me to be part of this committee. We're charged with the task of consulting the Australian people and reporting your views back to government. And the three questions uh, that we have to answer are which human rights and responsibilities should be protected and promoted? Are they sufficiently protected and promoted? And thirdly, how could Australia better protect human rights? Respect for these rights and responsibilities should guide the actions of our government and should inform the way we behave towards each other. However, not all of these rights are protected by our constitution or our laws, but we rely on them being protected through policy and services. This consultation is occurring because the federal government wants to know if the citizens of this country think that we're falling short in our protection of human rights. A Bill of Rights in the American model, where the rights are constitutionally entrenched, will not be considered. We need to leave with a clear idea of your thoughts and we need to have a record of them. So we're going to conduct some of the discussion in a large group and we're also going to have part of the discussion in the smaller table groups. We're certainly listening and it is, after all, the views of the public that we are going to put to the government. I expect there'll be some robust discussion um, in Cabinet and in Parliament about it. I found it very useful because I, I didn't really know a lot about the issue before but it really helped me to gain an understanding and it really showed me the power of my voice. Each table got to contribute their ideas about human rights which I was really happy that we did get to have a, have a voice. We were told at the beginning that the government has already taken off the table the idea of it being a constitutional bill. Now I personally object to the idea of the government engaging in community consultation but predetermining the advice that we're allowed to provide to them. My table certainly um, strongly agreed that we want to see a human rights charter. And the main thing will be what does Rudd do about it or will it be the same as carbon trading it just falls into a black hole. We couldn't fit everyone in today so clearly we're going to have to look at a bigger venue, uh, more consultation so I'm really sorry if people in Sydney were disappointed but we're going to try and provide another opportunity for you to come and have a say.